Hey guys, I decided the uh, second week in August ain't nothing like just put a big lot of uh, lamb stew on. I know it's hot and stewed really from cold weather, but I just got a craving for some lamb stew. I stumbled across a leg of lamb in the freezer. Hey, I'm gonna make it. So get back with your bit. We'll put this thing together. We'll have some lamb stew. See y'all in a bit. Hey guys, uh, took that leftover bacon I had and. Uh, I decided I'm gonna make some lamb stew today. So I'm uh, rendering it down, getting a little grease going, and uh, brown this bacon up. And I'll get the rest of my ingredients together, and we're gonna make lamb stew. It might be it might be summertime, and it might be the second week in August, but I just decided to uh, eat lamb stew to good in time. So just get back with me in a bit, and we'll get all this ingredients stew together, and we'll be cooking some lamb stew. See you in a bit, guys. I got my bacon cooked down, got it crisp, and that leg of lamb was about five or six pounds, but I cut it off the bone, and I'd say I probably got three, maybe three and a half pounds of lamb meat in this. I cut it up in like stew beef, and uh, we're gonna let that cook down a little bit, and I'm gonna go get a uh, can of tomato sauce, and then we're gonna add the tomato sauce and the potatoes and onions, and uh, we'll just go from there. So just get back with me here in short and uh, we'll get this thing going. We might be eating lamb stew before dark. See y'all in a bit. Bye. Hey guys, I got my meat uh, still brown in here. And I'm gonna add uh, one can of tomato sauce and one can of diced tomatoes. And uh, we're gonna put that in there and see where we're at. We'll let that cook down. And uh, then we'll think about adding our potatoes and our onions. I'd say that's going to be a meaty stew, what do you think? <laughs> I'll see y'all in a bit. Hey guys, we've got our tomato sauce in there and our tomatoes. And I've cut up uh, four large potatoes and about two onions. And i got a couple of three little cloves of garlic. I'm going to add it in there now. Did you? It did. Oh, you tough. That's right. All the tires on my hands. Did you tell them you added about you added water too? Yeah. I didn't have to do that because I know you was gonna have me. About 42 ounces of water to that tomato sauce and the and the uh, diced tomatoes. I think you're gonna need some more. Oh, we're gonna let that just cook down, let it thicken up. I'm actually gonna put the lid on it and. Uh, Check it in about 15 or 30 minutes, and we'll just go from there. Hey guys, we've been cooking about an hour now on this. Now I'm gonna add about a pound of uh, baby whole carrots. Oh! That's my little camera person. She's a, she's a wuss. Excuse me, I don't want that. First of all, I don't want that splashed on my dress. Ooh, ooh, and ooh. second of all, I don't want it splashed on my skin. Well, if you take your dress off, you wouldn't have to worry about it getting on there. We wouldn't have to worry about neighbors either. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we got potatoes, onions, carrots. We got diced You know tomatoes. what? I don't like lamb, but that does look good. And uh, some people, like I said, they don't like it. And instead of using black pepper, I'm going to use a tablespoon. I've kind of gotten a, I've kind of gotten a liking to this chipotle chili pepper, so I'm going to put a one yeah. tablespoon. Because we have it in everything. This chipotle chili pepper. Because I'm the only one's probably going to eat it anyway. Yeah, I ain't eat that. So uh, I don't eat lamb. Poor little, poor little baby sheep. I'm gonna give that a stir. Ain't lamb and sheep the same thing? Well, it is by DNA, but one's just slaughtered a little bit earlier. When they lamb. What do you say? One. I think you're wrong on that. No, lambs is babies, sheep is grown lamb. No, that's wrong. <laughs> you are so, so wrong. No. But you, as you can see, I had to do my wife some grilled chicken. That's so, right. Uh, we're gonna put the lid back on that. Did you did you add any salt to that? I didn't add no salt because you're always busting Mom, just about. We're gonna give us a quick stir. It's always looking good. I'd say another 30 minutes. If that, uh, 
You know, I don't like lamb stew, but again, that does look good. You know, I don't think it's gonna need another 30 minutes. My potatoes are done. I tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna set this off the heat. And that way it'll make room for uh, our sausage. Just bear with me a quick second. Let's get that. Hey guys, we got our lamb stew out. We got it dipped in a bowl. And I'm gonna enjoy it. Uh, Didn't even need any thickening, did you? No, no, it thickened up. It made a good broth. Uh, you can see it's got a good consistency to it. It's got a good smoky smell. And, uh, it's going. I know it's too, actually it's too hot for me because I don't like my soup hot. Not not steaming like this. A lot of people do. You'll but, burn uh, your guzzle. No, you burn my guzzle. Guzzle, guzzle, where's it go? Let's blow it a bit. <laughs> I ain't gonna. It is too hot. I ain't gonna film you on the thing. Uh, it looks good. Everything's done. Carrots is done. Carrot. Taters done. Taters is done. Uh, it's delicious. It's delicious. So, uh, if y'all was here, I'd offer you a bowl. But I guess I'm just going to be a hog and eat the whole thing myself. We'll see you next but, time. Uh, we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.